Okay, well, I hope this is working, folks. Um, welcome back to Mr. Blue Farms, a.k.a. Tommy Miller, here on Medicine Creek 19. Woohoo! Folks, how y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? I am doing just peachy. Lemon squeezy. Uh, y'all just have to watch Sarah DG. Uh, she's a YouTuber from New York. Uh, I do a lot. Oh, well, I don't do. I, I watch a lot of her videos. They're about computers, laptops, and stuff. So yeah, go check her out. Uh, uh, yeah, very popular. You should be able to find her, no problem. But anyway, today's video. First of all, I just hope and pray and, and wish that all y'all are having a awesome day. Um update on me I, i'm sorry to leave y'all hanging um i had three tooth three teeth pulled uh bottom uh right side uh i have no chompers on the bottom right left uh only thing left is my cutters on the front and two or three on the left bottom um, but yeah, you're probably getting tired of the mowing videos, so I figured, hey, I'm gonna wash these trailers, and, uh, this one here needs a lot of, of uh, TLC. This, uh, as you can see in the background there, the high boys over there, um, Kyle and Julian Vlogs just got through filling it up, and, uh, Christy, Nicola, and... Ice Demon and and uh, I think Mr. Yankee just brought the tractors in. I'm like, well, y'all go on home for a little bit, get some rest. We don't have too much to do today. Oh, I can't reach no further. Can I squirt it that far? Maybe. Don't know. But anyway, I sent them home early with pay. Don't worry, I got. I sent them home with pay. I, I'm a good boss like that. But uh, I might not get all these washed and stuff and repaired, but um, yeah, uh, let me roll this hose back up down through here. All right, y'all probably already seen it. It's in the background, folks. Y'all seen the thumbnail. Y'all know what it is. Yeah. But anyway, uh, we got to get another pressure washer. I need to get this thing outside before you use it all the time. Um, how much does it have? Uh, water just about out of and fuel is three quarters. Okay. Okay. But we got to get the 8R X back here washed, cleaned up, and put on the auger wagon. And I might well, no, I, I'm going to wait, let y'all wait a little bit. We're going to service this truck real quick. Oh, trailer. Okay, yeah, trailer needs it real bad. $460, probably air canister and airline maybe. Uh, the truck, oh, truck oil change. <gasps> no, 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 I don't want to sell it. No, no, B, no. Repair Y. $796, whew. Expensive oil change. Uh, what else we got? This there was two trailers. Okay, get out of here. Yeah, there we go. We're getting this fire up. It's kind of hard to play with no sound. Um, OBS is needing an update. Oh, 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 oh! Got to hook back up to the trailer. Yeah, OBS is needing a uh, update, so um, uh, like remind me later because I was already in the game. So I'm like, hmm. Yeah, it's one of those things. All right, what we got left to do is the fifth wheel back here. Oop, just ran over the jack. That's not good. Oh, the jack's over on the side. I don't know why I'm running over there. All right, let's see. I'm going to dump back trailer and pull this up just a little bit where it won't register and unhook it. Sometimes you can just wash them better that way. All right, 
Y'all waited. Oop. Y'all waited long enough. Folks, this is the McDon Mac McDon uh, Flex Draper header. This is ours. I bought this. Um, I bought it. Simple fact is it's it's a header that, that's like a trailer. We're going to get our head on the trailer. Oh, wait, wait. Anyway, this is the new X9 1000, folks. Finally got the, this is the demo. This is not the original. It, it's not, well, I guess it would be the prototype, wouldn't it? Or, or something like that. Ooh, they got that awfully close up there. Must got it rested on there. Oh, they didn't dent it, but. This is the new X9, and as you can see here, it's the demo version that came out. Built with pride in East Malone, Illinois. Woohoo! Built in the United States. Nothing against other countries, but, you know, we like to support our own. But, yeah, we are going to be using this, but, uh, unfortunately, I told, uh, Oh, I can't think of the the guys, the, the gentleman's name now. Uh, it's one of Roland Coe's uh, friends. Uh, I subbed to him the other day, and uh, yeah, so uh, check out Roland Coe's uh, YouTube, and you'll see uh, uh, his friend on there. Uh, they was multiplaying. I wish I could multiplay. I got so many mods, it would be hard to do. But anyway, folks, that is the new X9 with the Draper header. Uh, we also have the John Deere header that has the air. Y'all seen it on Long Oak? Let's see if I can get over there. Um, let me repair these two trailers here real fast before I forget. Well, well it's not two trailers, it's tra another trailer and a fifth wheel, 261, not bad, fifth wheel is going to be 77, all right, so that, the whole hay truck here, or bell trailer system is set up, all we got to do is, uh, I'm going to wash and repair this guy, I'm going to wash and repair all of these off screen, but this guy here is getting put on the green cart, um, like I, was, I don't know if I said it or not, but the driver brought the truck, I mean the combine, to the wrong shop. He's supposed to take it to the other one because of this is why. Um, this is our ground, uh, one and three. I don't know why I do this, I keep forgetting. One and three is canola, 19 and 18 is wheat. And we have a lot of fields that has wheats planted. And you're going to see quite a bit of fields are just about ready like ours. So once again, this year, I'm going to be taking a demo. The, uh, the equipment place is wanting me to take it around to all the different farmers if I have time and harvest their crops. To show off, you know, and, and uh, plus I, I said I'd do it on my YouTube channel too. He's like, oh, great. So Dave at the equipment shop here. Um, what just happened? Oh, there we go. Um, this guy here is uh, sitting here for a reason, and you'll see that in the next episode. Uh, the new planner. A grain drill. Oh, I am experiencing some lag. I'm like, oh, get out. Let me go down this other way and look back this other way. Okay. Y'all seen this in Long Oak? That's the belt fed. Uh, 45 foot and 13.7 meters. 645 FD. Uh, yeah, it, it's got the belt with the belt. So, yeah, that little belt goes back this way, and that rolls it through. Uh, but this air system here uh, comes out those yellow tubes there, and it blows air back this way. 
to getting all the fine seeds. So uh, we're going to be using this on our wheat. And we might just, I wish this had a trailer, you know. Well, it's, it's no problem of putting it on a trailer, but if you can just unfold it and it becomes a trailer, oh, that is so much easier. But anyway, that, that's the things we got. So we got to get that combine down here, pick this up, and carry it to field 19 and 18, because folks, tomorrow, tomorrow, I think, I think all this is going to be ready. And as far as uh, planting, come on, switch over. You can see, we, we got to do some weed control too. But this 5-4 is not planted. I want to get 1 and 3 harvested uh, so we can just plant 5-4 and 3 all together. And... Uh, I don't know if we have time to put soybeans into field one, but this is going to be cotton. Uh, one, 19, 18, and Mike going by field 27. And I'm wanting to do soybeans. Um, but cows, they're going to need to be watered and clean. And that's pretty much on all of them. Their food's good for now. Um, go over here. Soybeans. You can see soybeans goes all the way to the fourth day of summer that you can plant. So we'll get wheat and the canola harvested and should have time to plant and harvest it within this year. So that's what I'm shooting for. So, yeah, I don't know what I need to do now. Um, I guess I'm going to call this an episode. And, folks, I'm going to, like I said, get the rest of them washing and stuff. And come back tomorrow um, having the combine running. I guess I'm going to go ahead and order a trailer for this thing. Yeah. Might as well keep it. We'll have to see how they do. But anyway, I appreciate each and every one of y'all, folks. And don't forget, don't forget, folks, go down below. I got two links down there. One of them's on a can crusher, and another one's on a camera light that I just recently bought. If you don't want none of those two, don't worry about it. Still click on the link. It'll take you to Amazon. If you're going to make an order from Amazon anyway, just go down and click on my link buy what you want to buy through that link it'll help me out a lot uh i'm amazon affiliate but if i don't make no sales or anybody makes any sales through those two links within i think another I, I, don't get me a line to y'all i don't know how long it is but it's like 180 days or something like that 100 days uh if i don't make a sale through the either one of those links then uh, I have to reapply and all that junk so but if you're going to make a order anyway just drop down through those links you don't have to buy, get the can crusher or the the uh, light but you can go through those links to buy other stuff and it still help me out so and um, y'all want to send me some mail my address is down at the very bottom of the description box and also while you're there, I got PayPal. And the most important thing is there's other YouTubers down there that will treat you like family also. And that's what y'all are. Y'all my family. I need two more family members and I'll be happy, folks. I hit that 600 mark. After that 600 mark, I'm pushing for 1,000. I'm going to skip seven, eight, and 900 and go straight for 1,000 go. Uh... So, yeah. But anyway, um, this is an update video about my teeth, why I was out so much. Uh, probably an episode or two y'all missed. Um, might be another episode or two uh, after this. But after that, I should be back into the videos and maybe some vlogging also. 
So, folks, y'all have a wonderful, awesome day. I love each and every one of y'all. And I just can't get enough of y'all. Keep on commenting and liking my videos if you want to. And if you're new, hit that red button. I ain't going to make you. But I wish you would. Even love you more. <laughs> anyway, folks, y'all have a great day. A blessed day. And I'll see y'all later. Bye. I know it's a game.